All right. Uh, in this uh, stream, I'm going to be trying 11 different Haribo gummies and candies. Uh, this is a charity milestone unlocked for uh, Gamers Outreach. Um, we hit the 2000 mark. Um, and so this was the reward milestone. Um, for those of you watching, whether on Twitch or YouTube, you can donate down there, whether it's a Tiltify panel or a link on YouTube when this is uploaded later. Uh, and all proceeds go to Gamers Outreach uh, for Project Go Kart, um, uh, whose goal is to uh, provide children in hospitals with mobile video game stations uh, because kids need entertainment while they're stuck in hospitals. Um, so it's a great cause. Uh, please donate if you can. Uh, if we hit 4,000, we unlock a one-piece breeding stream. Um, so yeah, um, please donate if you are able. Uh, otherwise, uh, let's jump into it. Uh, we'll go through the 11 candies and um, whatever I don't... Uh, uh, or the rest of the time will be Q&A at the end. Now, for some reason, I thought I did this one already. Am I crazy? But I haven't, apparently. Did I do some kind of gummies? I don't I don't remember. I've done too many of these. But let's just let's just get to it. Um First off, you got let me let me just preface this. I don't like gummies very much. So this is gonna be super fun. We got Haribo Gold Bears, just your classic gummy bears. Limited time party hats. It's the hundredth anniversary. Guess uh, these guys have been going a hundred years. Better be a damn good bear then. Um, Get a special edition party hat as well. These are very tough. I kind of like my gummies softer, to be honest. They're also a little sour, but not too sour. Just kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of a little tough for me. I don't know. I'm, is this how they're normally supposed to be? Do people like? Do gummy lovers like tough gummies? It's not really my thing. They're okay. I'm gonna say. Hmm. B minus. They're completely fine for me. Um, and then I have the sour versions. Maybe these will be a little more up my alley. Maybe they're more like Sour Patch Kids or something. Just like sugar crusted. So, so tough. There's barely any difference. People like these. <laughs> these are indistinguishable to me in terms of flavor. And the fact that I'm sick of chewing when these are supposed to be sour and they're not, I mean, it was C. Plus. Oh boy. All right. Okay. Thank you very much, Drum and Bass, for the sub. Um, let's change up the, 
God, are these all the fucking same horrible texture? Let's try Haribo Watermelon. These feel more like marshmallowy, kinda. There we go. Hmm. First ingredient, sugar. Hmm. Soft and sweet. I can, yeah, that's a big difference. I like them. They're like pillowy soft, almost like marshmallow between the marshmallow and a gummy. Mmm, very pleasant. Yeah, that's a texture I like. And um, watermelon flavor is it's artificial, but it, it's nice. On the Haribo scale, give these an A+. Their texture is really nice. Doesn't make me want to quit the stream. All right. So some of them are labeled soft and fruity. Maybe I should um, switch between. So let's try happy cherries. These ones are not marked soft and fruity. So maybe these are back to chewy ass bullshit. Oh, these are very, looks like a fucking toy. Like you'd stick it onto a wall or something. Come. Okay. Better than the bears, because one, they're flatter. So they're flatter, so they're less tough. The bears are so thick and tough. These are flat, you know. The thing, the thing is, they're only cherry, and cherry is like bottom tier flavor for me. So I think they're okay. I think they're better than the bears. I'll say because the texture is okay, uh, I'll say B. I'll say happy cherries. Get a B from me. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm going to save these. There's another one that's called Soft and Fruity. I'm going to save those for the end because those might be the ones I like best. Let's do... Uh, these apparently are new. Rainbow Worms. These are probably almost exactly the same as the bears. Very thick. Let me ask those in the chat who are gummy fans. Do you like tough chew like gummies? Like that, that just like you chew a long time? Or do you like them softer? Mm. Most of the chat is saying soft. I agree. These are better than the Haribo Bears. These are about on par with what I expect from gummy worms. Like, they're just your average gummy worm. Um, yeah, I'd say like a B. Like, they're fine. Um, maybe I, I might get like them a little softer than this, but I can deal with this texture. They are not as not as tough as the Bears. I'm going to get water for a palate cleanser because it's already getting crazy with the sweetness.
All right. Um. Then we have Happy Cola. I tend to like the cola flavored um, snacks. But we'll see. These, um, I got like a, looks like half full. The fact that I'm going for a second says a lot. These are nice. Got that nice kind of cola, almost, um, mm, how do you describe it? Really is just like cola. Um, very soft, I like that. Um, soft, I like the cola flavor. Um, I mean, the fact that I'm going for a third. A plus. I like these a lot. They've got kind of an addictive quality to them. With the chew and the sweetness just right. Not bad at all. Thank you, Nanas, for donating. Alright. I picked up the sweet or scary mix. And there's two snacks in here. There's ghostly gummies and sour vampire bats that are different than uh the rest are just gummy bears. So let's see here. However, I have a feeling these are all just going to be almost exactly the same. So it's ghostly gummies. They're just little, it's like a little pumpkin. And you know, like a bat. And we're back to the tough ass shit again. I guess that's the default, huh? My ratings of these are just going to get worse and worse. C. And then let's try the Sour Vampire Bats. I think these are going to be almost exactly the same. They probably won't even taste sour. Okay, they got like a sour flavor. Problem is, I don't like sour that much. So, it's hypocritical because I gave the sour candies earlier shit for not being sour. But now that I have these, I'm like, I don't like sour. Um, yeah, I don't like the, the sour, like, like a Sour Patch Kid has a nice sugar sweet and the sour, that's just kind of sour, not my thing, um, D, I'm gonna give those a D, I don't like them, oh, okay, we got Sour Streamers Zing, Sounds like a fruit leather.
This is just something I can't eat as an adult. It's so sickly sweet and sour. Not chewy in a satisfying way. If I were a kid, I'd probably like this more. I don't like this now. And yeah, the, the sweet sour balance is not there for me. And the texture is not amazing. It's not tough, but it's a little... It's right in that weird gray area of like... It's not soft. It's not tough. It's just in the middle, so there, it lacks either appeal. Oh, boy. Um, C minus. D, D plus. I'm going to say D plus. Okay. I can't even finish this. All right. Sour Skeddy. Zing. Okay, this is going to be almost exactly the same. The worst part is not the sour, which I, I'm not crazy about, but it's the texture. It's really gross. This is like the toughest, not, I mean, not tough, but like, yeah, it's tough, tough licorice. Like, immediately sticks to your teeth. Almost like a grainy. It immediately just, it's like hard and then it breaks into little sticky chunks. I hate this. F. No, thank you. Now I got fucking skeddy stuck in my teeth. God. All right. Palette cleanse. How are those peaches? These are soft and fruity. I'm hoping these will take me back around. I can feel the difference already, I think. Mmm. Mmm. They're very sweet, but it's got that great pillowy marshmallow gummy um, texture. Um, this is S tier. Really nice, you know, peach flavor, very sweet, very pleasant. Chewy texture. I mean, I'm not chewy, soft texture. It's like little peachy pillows. Mm. I knew this is one I would like. Mm. Those are those are legit good. Okay. So that was all the Haribo candy. Overall, sour stuff don't like. The bears too tough. The super sour candy is either tough. Too tough or too sour or both. Um, the peaches and the watermelon are both really pleasant. The peaches are the best ones, but these are legit good. Coca-Cola ones are good. Not Coca-Cola. The cola ones are good. Um, everything else I can pass on. Even the cherry ones. I'm like They're okay. I wouldn't get them again, but... As someone who doesn't really like super sweet gummy candy, these are both these are both good, and the peaches are legit great. Hmm, it's good. All right, so that was the Haribo 
Um, for the rest of the hour, um, let's do a Q&A. So, how this is going to work. If you donate to the charity and write a question with your donation, I'll prioritize your questions. Um, so please donate if you can. Uh, otherwise, I'll just shoot, pick and choose from the side. But uh, if you want your question picked for sure, please donate um, to the charity. Those, those peach gummies are so, like, such a perfect texture. Because, like, the, the marsh, like, marshmallows are too soft. But it has, like, just the right amount of chew where it's really, like, satisfying. That's, like, the perfect texture. But I got to put these away or else I can see myself just eating too many of them. Would you rather eat a whole bag of the berries or do distortion dimension again? Um, so distortion dimension is in the... I, I recently played Pokemon Platinum. I'm playing it randomized. Um, and this, the distortion room is very long and tedious and annoying. But I'd still rather do that because eating a whole bag of the berries would make me sick. I mean, eating the whole bag of any of these would make me sick. Um, favorite board game right now? Um, I mean, if you're talking about what I'm playing lately, uh, I'm enjoying Aeon Zen Legacy of Gravehold. Um, but I have been playing some Marvel Legendary expansions, and that is my favorite game of all time. So I've been enjoying that quite a bit. Um, yeah. Keep the questions coming, or else I'm just gonna sit here for an hour. Um... And like I mentioned before, if you donate, uh, I'll prioritize your question. And if you're watching on YouTube later, uh, I apologize, but nobody's asking questions. Sorry for the awkward pause. Have you played Vampire Survivors? I don't know what that is. Uh, no, oh, I've heard of this, but no, I have not played this. Um, let's see. Do you have any web comics or indie comics in general you're reading right now? Not really. I used to read a lot of web comics, but I've kind of uh fallen out of it but back in the day i did used to have like a regular list of stuff i would check on um my favorite type of pizza is sausage uh did you get egg haribos no i don't know what those are but i probably wouldn't have liked them anyway um have you played monopoly cheaters edition i have not have you had Detroit style pizza? Um, I uh, love Detroit style pizza. It's great. Um, the donations are counting, but the questions aren't being shown. Are you sure you're donating to the right charity? I can double check. But if it's not, I because I can literally go to the page. Ah. You are correct. Let's see. Um, in your thank you for your donation, Salty Vigilante. Vigilante. Uh, in your opinion, best and worst fast food places. Um, best, if it counts, Steak and Shake. Um, worst, uh, Burger King is definitely one of the worst. Um, and if Steak and Shake doesn't count or Shake Shack. Then, I mean, I love, like, McDonald's, Taco Bell, Wendy's. Yeah. 
Um, did you finish reading Chayapura? I don't read the manga. Thank you, Tracy, for your donation. But uh, no, I don't read the manga. Um, yeah. Please continue donating if you can. Uh, if you make a donation but the notification doesn't pop up for whatever reason, let me know. Because uh, I can check the site and I, I can see them all. If you have a question on there. Um, favorite type of rice? Just, you know, classic white rice. Um, the Haribo selection. You'll see later when I upload this later. on. I'll, this will be on YouTube, so you can see the selection there. Auntie Anne's or Wetzel's Pretzels? Auntie Anne's. Played any of the Freebird games? I uh, don't know what that is. Freebird. Oh, uh, they did To the Moon? I haven't played that, but I've heard good things, but I have not. Um, what is your favorite Mario Kart character slash kart combination? I don't know the carts offhand, but Wario is my go-to, always. Um, favorite type of cheese? Parmigiano Reggiano. Um... Who is best waifu? My actual wife. Um, how's the wife? She's good. Doing good. Top five anime. Chihaya Furu, Monster, Mushishi, Cowboy Bebop, and Sound Euphonium. why this thing is not updating or not giving me the notification and somebody if somebody would be would be kind enough to give a donation so i can see if it does the thing or not that'd be nice because i definitely need this to work for tomorrow's stream um keep the questions coming Would you rather watch Akumetsu or Alice in Borderland? I have no idea what those are. Okay, that worked. Thank you, Tracy, for your donation. Is this thing on? It is now. Also, for those of you who want to, I'm doing a weird food combo stream again. Uh, so if you follow me on Twitter, go check out and reply to that tweet if you have suggestions for it. Uh, thank you, Jared, uh, for your donation and test donation for question for your donation. Testing, testing, testing. It's working, working good now. Um, and and if if you answer ask a question but it doesn't show, uh, please let me know and I'll go check it. Um, let's see. What's your favorite scent of candle? I'm not really a candle guy. Uh, are you the drinking water on Reddit guy? I guess. Salty Vigilante, thank you for your donation. Worst anime you've hate-watched all the way through. Hate-watch is a strong word. Um, I recently, Twitter voted for me to watch Planet With for a charity milestone, and so I had to watch it, and I really did not like it. Uh, so that's definitely when that comes to mind. 
I guess I guess that would be my answer. I thought it was very nothing. Um, if I send you a video, will you watch it? No. Keep those questions coming. We're about halfway through the stream. Where are the cats? Uh, they are elsewhere. They are in a different part of the home. They're not allowed here. Although, I wish they were here. How the day? The day good. I guess while I'm waiting for questions, I can start collecting what I'm gonna eat in this next stream. But please keep the questions coming. Last time I tried a bunch of stuff and, excuse me, um, it was all like, honestly, not bad. There was nothing that was like disgusting or anything. Um, Have you played Disney's Villainous? Yes, I have. Have you seen any of the Seven Wonders of the World? Let me remind myself of what the actual Seven Wonders of the World are. Um, if we're talking about the new Seven Wonders... Uh, I don't think so. No. Thank you, Kubi7, for your donation. What's a video game you thought you'd like but actually hated? Hate is a strong word. I was just talking about this the other day with some friends, but The Last Guardian was a big disappointment for me. I couldn't get very far in it because I, I thought it was very frustrating. Um, Zero Time Dilemma was a big disappointment. Um, what is the last magazine you read? God, I don't... I have no idea. Uh... last magazine like as a regular reader I used to get Game Informer a long time ago but I guess it'd be that maybe played any living card games living card games like a, oh yeah I played Arkham Horror the card game that was pretty good but I only played the base Thank you, uh, Ali G, for your donation. Would Wario, voiced by Charles Martinet, being the surprise main character, save the Mario movie for you? It would definitely help. They would never do it. Uh, I think that movie is going to be an absolute turd. Um, have you traveled a lot? Where would you like to go next? I haven't traveled a lot, but I've traveled a decent amount. I would. I think the place I want to go next out of the country is... I want to return to Japan. I've been there twice, but I'm itching to go back again. Um, in terms of new places, okay. I would love to go to Australia, uh, go back to Korea, go to Europe, a bunch of places. Thank you, Jared, for your sub. Um, 
favorite game I played this year? If we're not talking like released this year, but just that I played this year. Mm, maybe Kiwami 2. Uh, that might be my answer. Arceus was pretty good too. You like the taste of cilantro? Um, I don't hate it. It's okay. Keep those questions coming and donations if you can. What's the most difficult board game to set up and put away? Most difficult? Uh, I guess one of the super intricate ones. I don't have a great answer for this off the top of my head. Um, maybe like a Twilight Imperium, I guess, because they're so dense. Thank you, McBummies, for your donation. How did the brother die in Pizza Brothers? Oh, that's a spoiler. I can't. I can't share that yet. You'll have to. You have to keep watching and find out. Who played any skirmish tabletop games? Skirmish games. Uh, if Star Wars X-wing miniatures game counts, then yes. Uh, worst game you've ever played. I don't know. Ton, there are a ton of shit games I've played. I can't think of like the absolute worst one. Am I too late for the gummy eating contest? Uh, this will be uploaded later, so you can watch it later on YouTube. Um, what's your favorite thing to voice act? Uh, you know, Kage and Rankin Kings, Hyodo and Agretzko, Black and Borderlands 3.
Let's see. Tomato soup or chicken noodle? Tomato soup. Easy. Um, favorite instant ramen is Shin Ramen. Um, favorite video game soundtrack, Final Fantasy IX. Um, I believe I have heard of the sugar-free gummy bear story, yes. some of these food recommendations and like wow would you do name the anime and I go to with the J again uh, no because they get copyright flagged what did you eat this morning uh, unfortunately I had Burger King because the next food video I'm working on is Burger King um what is the best soup and why is it potato soup? Mm. I feel like my absolute favorite soup is like a really good lobster bisque or something, actually. You ever shave your head? I've done it before twice. Um, sure. If, uh, if there was a good cause or something, I'd do it again. Um, have you ever played Beyblade? Uh, not actually, but I there's a video of me on my channel where at a con where I played Beyblade very poorly. Would you ever do a food tier list? I feel like that's all my trying food videos are food tier list, unless this is a facetious question um, Have you ever regretted making any of your videos? No. What's your favorite video you've ever made? Uh, I don't know. I think I, I did a video where I'm talking about my favorite skits. You know, my the Pizza Brother ones lately have been very fun for me. So maybe those? I don't know. I don't really watch my own stuff. Do you like Metroidvanias? I haven't played a ton, actually. Um, I like the concept, but I haven't really played a ton. What video game systems do you own? 
Uh, oh boy. I own uh, the Switch, the PlayStation 4, the PlayStation 3, the PlayStation 2, uh, Wii U, GameCube, N64, SNES, I think? Um, 3DS, uh, Game Boy Advance SP, um, let me look at our list on the Let's Play channel, which for, by the way, those of you who don't know, Pros that he plays games is my Let's Play channel. It's a pretty good channel. So what I have on there is the Switch, Wii U, PS4, oh yeah, the 360, PS3, PS2, GameCube, Game Boy Advance, N64, we have a Genesis, a Dreamcast? Do we have a Dreamcast? I think we do. A Wii, a Super Nintendo, a Sega Saturn, and a 3DS. Um, so yeah. Uh, have you considered switching to stream on YouTube? Uh, maybe one at some point, but I've already put too much into Twitch at this point. Um, which platform do you own the most games for? I don't know offhand. I have to look at my game shelf. I feel like if I had to guess... God, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe 3DS or DS? Uh, have you met any of your idols slash celebrities you admire? Oh yeah, a bunch. Um, it's been... Some random examples, like... Uh, Patrick Warburton, Suda51, um, you know, a bunch. Um, have you ever tried to invent a word slash phrase and get it to stick? I think jokingly, but not actually. Uh, yeah. Do you have any Halloween plans? I think just keep it low key. Might have some friends over. Just play some games, watch a movie, eat candy, just chill. Favorite dessert, uh, some kind of pie or cheesecake or something with a really nice crust. What is this light? Oh, the, the sun is shining. Wow, this beautiful, has this light been here this whole time or just now? Uh, my cam is just like a Logitech fucking webcam 1080p thing. Uh, wow. Oh. Oh, talking about pie. Um, what would you game? What's the game you would like to see a remaster for? Hmm. Maybe uh, I don't know, Final Fantasy Nine or something.
ever experienced the Tomba games? Um, no, I don't think so. Would you ever consider hosting an event or moderating a panel of some sort? Um, I maybe if, if I guess it would depend on what it was. To be useless skill, one could argue that all my skills are useless. I wonder if they'll ever start updating or remastering board games. Uh, there's a, there's a whole company that does that. Uh, Restoration Games. They do a great job. They do. They did Fireball Island. Um, uh, Unmatched, I think, was originally like the Star Wars dueling game that they turned into a. Yeah, that that Restoration. That's their whole purpose. Return of Dark Tower, Downforce. Um, they take old games and update them to the modern day for, and they're they're great, really great um, packages. Therefore, you would consider evil. <coughs> evil? Evil is a strong word. Ortolan is pretty wild. <sighs> um, any recommendations from Restoration Games? I already listed a bunch, but I think Unmatched is one of their best ones. Down for their down Downforce is good. Least favorite Ace Attorney game? Five. Favorite Korean food, Kalbi. Um, what do I think of the city pop genre? Is that the okay? Yeah, I have a friend. Steve was really into city pop. Um, yeah, I like it. From what I've heard. Um, I have not played Investigations Two. Investigations One is on a replay. Might be down near the bottom of worst games in the Ace Attorney series, I will say. It's not a very good replay. Um, let's see. Blue, red, or brown switches. I'm not sure what you are talking about.
Oh, mechanical keyboards. I know. I don't know anything about mechanical keyboards. What game should I start with if I want to get a Days Attorney? Why just start with the first one? It's always a strange question when people. What do I start with the 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 first one? If you had to remove one entire Pokemon from existence, I get asked this a lot, and I don't. I can't. I don't know. There's not one where I like. I hate it so much. I want it gone. Have you ever tried the Dvorak keyboard setup? I have no idea what that is. Um, oh God, uh, no interest. That seems awful. You thought about collecting the One Piece trading cards? Uh, maybe. Depends on if the art is good. Or if I get into the gameplay, or both. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm interested. But I haven't looked too much into it uh, at the moment. Um, we are almost done with the stream. If anyone wants to send any last donations to the charity, please do. Let me check and see if I didn't miss any questions that went through. Um, okay, I think I'm caught up on all those. Yeah, if you do any last donations here, I will prioritize your questions before we uh, sign off. Um, let's see. What is your favorite Mexican food dish? It's tough. Like, I think for me, it might just be as simple as like some good tacos like I love like lengua like you know tongue uh, that's like one of my favorites so something like that just keep it simple If you could have a fast food place built into your house and have access to its international menu 24-7, what would it be? I feel like the answer's got to be McDonald's then, because international means all the McDonald's variants, and there's just so much out there, so I think it'd have to be that. Um, Alright, I think that's going to be it for this stream. Thank you all uh, for your donations, um, and uh, yeah, if you want to donate... To gamers outreach there is a totify panel down there or if you're watching on youtube later there is a link to the charity down there uh i'm gonna stop the recording now